number three. Get a different color. Okay. If I've got a rectangular prism and it's shown like this, I, I generally just use, use the bottom and the top rectangles as my basis. But we talked about, I'm sure we talked in class, our Zoom class, and I talked on problem one that you've got options there. So the volume of any prism is equal to the area of the base multiplied by the height. The area of the base equals base times height for any parallelogram. And so for this parallelogram, uh, 3.8 multiplied by 5.2. So the area of the base is 19.76 19 and 76 hundredths so the volume of the prism is equal to 19 and 76 hundredths multiplied by the height of the prism the height of the prism is the perpendicular distance between these two rectangular bases that I've shaded so the height of the prism is 2.7 when you multiply those you get 53.352 uh, centimeters cubed. See anything like that here? 53. Oh, exactly, right there. CH. So 3 is CH. 1 was TH. 2 was NE. Problem number four.